yo I go on my viewers and subscribers I'm coming at you of course with another tutorial and this mighty one is from the mighty diamonds a classic you know what I mean if you don't know the original if you don't know this one the link is down there to the original so you can go ahead and have a listen and come back here yeah man so we ain't gonna spend too much time talking just remember to subscribe to the channel remember to share and always remember to hit the thumbs up button all right it does a lot a great amount of you know it it's just good for me let's put it that way anyways let's start in let's get to this one this one is we only using three simple cards all right but they had a little bit of sugar that's where that pinky finger comes in this is why you must never never ever ignore the pinky finger all right always find time to build that cool so yes we're gonna use we, this song is in the key of c c major and my bad the title of this song is roof over my head some people will say i need a roof over my head right but yeah doesn't matter once there's a roof right cool all right so um you can use this C if you want to, but why I use this one, it's because it cuts through the mix way better for me, alright? So, um, so we're going to be moving from a 1 to a 2 for the first part, cool? So, you want to come all the way up here to the 8th fret. By the 8th fret, place that middle finger on the 3rd string, 9th fret, pinky finger on the 4th string, 10th fret, ring finger on the fifth string 10th fret now normally I would use a lot of the, um, the thinner strings but we're just gonna come up a little bit more and play a little bit more of the thicker strings also we're gonna include that so not the big one we don't need that one really all right so we're moving from that to the D minor, we're not gonna use this one. That, that is just a little bit too high for me, you know. So we're gonna use this one. All right, so it's, it sounds a bit more chunky, you know. And of course, yeah, as you can hear, my guitar is clean. I always practice clean. Cool. So we're gonna bar the whole fifth fret. You wanna place the middle finger on the second string of the sixth fret, ring finger on the third string. 7th fret, not the ring finger, my bad, <laughs> the pinky finger, then the ring finger is on the 4th string 7th fret, so again, bar the whole 5th fret, middle finger 2nd string 6th fret, pinky finger 3rd string 7th fret, ring finger 4th string 7th fret. So now, we're here. right and of course the strumming pattern is just one one scan but of course you know at times I use a little bit of double scan you know and some slides as you can see you know at the intro cool so that's basically the I need a roof over my head I need a roof over my head then and then so now that right there is the E minor which is the third so no matter what you do you always go back to the two all right so now you wanna the E minor is just like the D minor the second so you also wanna push this upper hole like that so now the pointer finger is barring the whole seventh fret you know Middle finger is on the second string, 8th fret, pinky finger on the third string, 9th fret, ring finger, 4th string, 9th fret. Cool. So now, I need a roof over my head. I need a roof over my head. And breathe. You know, okay, so that's basically it. 
for that. So um, that little thing right here, you wanna add that. Right, so that's the D minor still. Some people just play. Some people cheat and do that. You know, that's really that string. You know, the C. So um, so what I do. Okay. D minor, then you want to place the pinky finger on the first string, 8th fret. Even when you do this, you come back. You know, but you got to control the strings, of course. And to control the strings, it's the palm. You just want to come back quick enough to hold that, you know. And if you do not know the way of the strum reggae, reggae strum pattern, I, I did a video for that. I'm going to leave a link for that in the description. In fact, I'm going to put it in all the descriptions of all my videos, right? From now on. <laughs> Let's put it that way. So, yeah. So, that's basically it. So, um, so what you get right there is... So what I'm doing right there is I am just adding a little bit of, you know, a little bit of a. So for you to learn and to know that you need to go to that video that I was telling you about, I'm going to leave a link to that in the description. So um, for all those who don't know, and of course a slide. Sometimes a. Now these, you're not going to add a lot of this in the song, you know, every now and then you're going to switch it up, you know, so you, it's just a little bit of spice, a little bit of sugar, right, because you don't want to just, even though some songs require that, for you just, to just hold the rhythm line, alright, so you just want to, Okay, so you just have to, have to be quick with it. It takes time. Just remember to go slow. Practice slow. Don't try to just do it fast. All right? And you will be fine. My name is Zion, and that is how you play Roof Over My Head by the Mighty Diamonds. <laughs> remember to subscribe. Remember to hit the thumbs up button. Remember to turn on the post notification, you know? That way, whenever I post a new video, you will be alerted. All right? See you next time. One love.